Welcome back to Aisha's Tech Studio. This is a part 2 of our photo management application in Android Studio. Today we are going to create the ability to open the image. Suppose I click on any picture. As I have used the library zoom image view. So I can also zoom at it at any position. So now let's get started. I'm going to create a new activity which I will name as view picture. Now first of all we are going to design the layout of this activity. I will put three options here edit, share and details view. We are also creating a label for each of these icons. Now I will create two other copies of this two. I will also create a back button. And now we will use the zoom image view library just for the ability to zoom. So now let us implement the library. I'm just pasting the code. Adjust the size and constraints.
Now you can also set sample data. Now we move on to the gallery adapter. We will create the function of when the user will click on any picture just like this. So you will have to get the image file string and then you will have to transfer it to the view picture activity. So we are going to create the same function. Image set on click listener. So we are going to create a new intent. Through this put extra command, we are going to transfer the image. Let us move on to the view picture class. First of all, we will initialize some values such as the image view. And the image file string. Now how do we set the value of the image file? So as you have seen in the gallery adapter class, we had used a intent put extra command and we have used image file as the key so we are going to use the same key to get the path of the image just make sure that this is same as the key okay it should be image file only Now here we will create a file, we will put the image path and we will check if the image file exists. What if the user have already deleted the image? So if the user have deleted the image then obviously we can't show the file and the app will be crashed. So just to avoid this scenario. We will put the condition if the file exists. So only if the file is existing, then in the view picture class, the image will be shown. So glide with this activity, load the image file into the image view. image so now let us run this application and see the preview but before that please subscribe my channel and like this video and share with others thank you so much let us see the preview